Hey guys, another video from Raz Grease 2006 on PB Nation. I um, wanted to talk about a couple of things. Uh, there's going to be a lot of splicing going on in this video. So you're just going to have to believe me when I say it's legit, because it is. Uh, so, one, one common complaint I hear from people who get the DM14 is they say the bolt is really hard to get out. Now, one person in particular, I don't remember exactly who he was, but he said that the red tip of this was ruined because he was shoving a squeegee down his barrel or down the breech to try and push this out. Now, when I first got mine, it was, it was hard to push out. It was, definitely. And uh, we're going to try a tweak here in a little bit. To see if it'd be a little easier to pull out. Now, some of the factors I've noticed that contribute to this the most is it's not about how much lube you have on. It's not about really anything to lube except for one thing. What really it comes down to is time. Now, there's a whole lot you can read about stiction and how it applies to O-rings and sealing surfaces, but basically what you need to know is the longer this just sits here, the harder it is to pull out. But um, Something I want to show you real quick for when you do have trouble getting. Stick your finger and push, and then at the same time, all right, I can do this, but I'm trying. I'm trying to do it in a way that the camera can see. Push and pull at the same time. I mean, two different um, sources of, of force will get it done a little faster. So that's that. Uh, all right, so we're back. I have taken all of the stock die O twenties off and I've replaced them with 019 McMaster car 70s. Now uh, some people have thought that this might be a solution to the uh, having a hard time pulling out the o-rings. Um, my, my feeling is is if this does work uh, 19s are cheap enough uh, this whole bag cost me $3. They're, they're cheap enough to where if you feel like doing it, go ahead and do it. I wouldn't recommend doing it with the O20s because soft O20s are expensive and it's just not worth doing for how much extra effort it is to just use two fingers and pull it out. But I'm going to go ahead and put this in here and see if it seals. And I can tell you right off the gate, this is a little easier to do just because there's less squash on the O-ring. Uh, but here we go. We air it up, no leaks. It's a little late at night, so I'm not gonna not gonna let this fully cycle. Doesn't really matter. Yeah. So O nineteens work. 